What's up guys, this is Save Knight, and welcome to another Let's Play series. And welcome to Act Razor for the Super Nintendo. 1991 Enix and Quintet, License My Nintendo and all that jazz. Go ahead and do a new game. I've actually done this game already. But I'm starting to go back through all my playlists and redo all my old ones that were done not crappily, but they were done on like either Fraps or Windows Recorder, and I'm redoing them on the newer software and hardware that I have. And I'm also going to probably redo them a little bit better. Okay, enter your name, all this other stuff. Press button and do things. Okay. Ah, god damn it. Are you awake? Sir Save Knight, I am the angel sent to help you recover your lost strength. Now, all types of monsters are in control of the earth. This all came about because of a demon they called Tanzra, the one who sealed your power. In order to restore your power, you will need to rekindle the people's faith in you. But first, let us go down to the earth and destroy all monsters that we may establish a peaceful land for our people to dwell in. Alrighty. Um, like I said, I'm gonna um, do this a little bit better. See if we can just not do it as crappily as I did last time. Oh. First things first, change this to that. Alrighty. Go ahead and I'll just save it just because. Got my fucking butt keeps sticking. Do feel more, which is the first area that you have to do. If they are level locked. If you try to do here, it'll say... Must be at least level 2. So, feel more. Fight monsters. If we destroy all monsters in the land, people will be able to live here again. Are you ready to go down? Yes. That's actually slightly different from the actual um, story in the book. I didn't say he sealed your power, it's just him and all of his lieutenants all ganged up on you, almost killed you, that you cast them out, sealed yourself inside the palace, and then left in some weird, like, alternate plane something or another to recuperate. When you came back, everyone's gone, so all your power's gone too. And you're just... You're, um... You possess, you're possessing like an old statue. Come on. Shit. God, I really like the battle music for um, this area. I don't know why. Nope, wrong way. But what I'm actually going to do is, uh, like I did last time, trying to get my score to like a certain number, but I actually spent like 15-20 minutes in this area just fighting shit, waiting for the time to run down, because I think it starts with like 5 minutes on your actual timer. This is like a very loud click, I hope that's not showing up in the thing. But um, I'm going to go ahead and try to get my max score that's required to uh, max out my population in the first act. This is always easier to do it in the first act. Damn it. So I'm actually going to just sit here and let my time run down, killing shit, just to show you like the trick to actually get it done. And then I'll just cut to when I come back with my score, what I want it to be. Uh, Uh. 
God, I really love this battle music. This is the only fucking area in the game that plays this particular theme. Uh, and I'm not sure why, it's fucking badass. I also like the one for, um, um, North Wall 1, uh, or Act 1. Shit. Say, like, upper left corner, act, like, for action mode. Not even like halfway. I need, I think, 21,000. Ah, come on, you bastard. spending 20 fucking minutes doing this because I actually let the timer run down I think like four times actually showing all the you know action in between it's like yeah, let me go back and do that again and just show it once damn because I want to say ow bastard And the thing is, you don't have to do it, but this allows me to maximize my population quicker than having to wait around to the end of Act 2. It'll actually make me more prepared for Act 2, if anything, and like future acts when I do the same thing in like other areas. God, this battle music! Ow! You fucking bastard! Time up. And the reason why I did that, I stayed in that area because if you go beyond a certain point, it'll mark it off as being the second half of the area and I wouldn't be able to come back. Ow. Okay, this helps. So I can come back and. This part, I mean, this part, and boom, went up. So I just got my life back. So I'm going to just sit here and just do this off screen to get my like 21,000 points or whatever the crap it was, and then just pick up back right here from like a new life and just finish out the stage. So I'll be right back. Alrighty. So, I'm way beyond my score. I think I only need like 21,000 or something like that. I'll get like the exact number and I'll put it in like the description. So now I'm gonna just play it through. God, this is really fucking loud. So that's not like showing up on the recording. I'm playing on hardware, by the way. Like, an, I have the actual ActRaiser cartridge in my Super Nintendo. like clean my controller or something. Okay, now I can just mosey on through. Okay, this is actually the halfway point. If I jump off here and then die beyond this point, it'll start me back right here. Okay, that was a something. I forgot what it was. Okay, 
it took me no time at all. And there we go, the Act 1 boss for Fillmore, Centaur. Hot pocket. Completely forgot about that. Each life is like a thousand score. And then you... Revivitate the people. Sorry, I'm patting my windscreen. I fucking got sauce all over it. Okay. Sir Phil... No, I'm Sir Philmore. Sir Save Knight. Philmore may become a land where people can live in peace. Our first duty... Ha, he said duty. Is to protect our people from any monsters. I will do as you instruct. Please rid the land of monsters with my arrows. There are several mysterious circles on the ground which represent monster layers. If you direct the people correctly, they will be able to seal the monster layers. Hold on, this is hot. We'll discover the monster that controls this land. If destroyed, control of this land, its destiny will return to her people. Alright, my master, let us work towards peace. I know it's unexpected, but our people in Fillmore have something to tell you. My master, we are having a difficult time building homes because of many bushes. Please burn the bushes and guide us as we begin to build our roads. Building direction, let us listen, and your miracles, which is a finger pointing down from the heavens. Literally. Your lightning can destroy houses, fields, rocks, palm trees, and bushes. Yes, I will. Stupid fucking bat. No! Stop it! Bat. Ah. Stupid fucking napper bat. That's another thing that they actually did. The um, original monster layers actually had like emblems of like the Star of David or some shit like that. And it's, oh no, we can't have religion in our games because we're fucking whiny assholes in America. Back in like 1990s, we were afraid of offending people. Ah, oh, fuck. So you get one magic point back for everything you kill, and this is those you get two. Or spell power, I'm sorry. Ah, you. Ah. And for Fillmore, um, each area will have, always have four monster layers, and each one will have a, pre, a um, preset number of base monsters. Fuck. Like, Fillmore is... Fuck. 500 monsters spread across four layers, so that's 125 apiece. Score. Fuck. <sighs> Dick. Will determine um, additional uh, monsters. You actually get like one additional monster every 50 points that you earn in Act 1. <sighs> Damn it. Fuck.
so like, uh, let's say if I would have uh, run through the act, not killed anything, and then you know, like beat the boss, then come started here, the numbers will say one thing compared to what they will say now if I actually look at them. Something to tell you, okay. Our master, we have finally mastered the skill of hunting animals. We now have enough confidence to fight monsters. Please lead us to the monsters' lairs. I was doing that. Keep hitting the wrong fucking button, goddammit. Derpy her, but derp. God, what the fuck you want now, people? Recently, strange things have been happening to me. Many, many of my thoughts actually come to life in the real world. If these powers are real, I feel the presence of something holy radiating from the woods east of here. And you just build into that little area right there. Our people have sealed the monster's lair without our help. It appears someone has found something in the monster's lair. My master, we have found a strange bow and some arrows. We present this to you as an offering. Please accept it. Come here, just take offering. Strength of Angel. You use it and it increases your attack power. Congratulations, your level has increased. Now your level is 2 and your HP are 9. Oh, by the way, your level will increase again when the total population becomes 200. radiating from under the big rock below the precipice southeast of here. Something may be buried there. My master, please use your powerful lightning to destroy this rock. As soon as I'm stealing my shit. found near the precipice to the southeast of here. We present it to you as an offering. Please accept it. Okay. <sighs> Wrong way, cunt.
Strange statue presents its you as an offering. Please accept it. No. Stupid fucking thing. Ah. Again at 400. We have developed a fishing trade here in Fillmore. A few days ago, a fisherman repairing his boat along the seashore found this unusual scroll. Said it's here as an offering, yada yada yada. Okay, there's a bomb. Do you MP? Smashing got magical fire. level of Fillmore seems to have improved. Quite a new skill and can now build bridges. With a way to, to cross the river, we can build homes there. Call it right here. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and just call it here, and the, everything actually stops when you leave. Uh, when we come back, I'm gonna drop back down to Fillmore, and I'm going to probably f take out that last monster lair thing and probably head towards the boss. So, until then, this is Save Knight on Let's Play Act Razor. Later, guys.